Hey everybody and welcome to Candy Camouflage. My name sure. is Simone and this is George and this is where we watch movies and television. We're doing Jackie Brown. Yes. This movie. One of Tarantino's earliest movies. This movie has been on my list for a long time. Poster's black and white. The font for the title is very similar to, uh, to Pulp Fiction. It's that yellow red. We have, uh, I guess that's Pam Greer. Um, pointing a gun at us, looking right at the lens. Next to her is Samuel Jackson holding a gun. And then Michael Keaton next to him, uh, wearing sunglasses. And Robert De Niro on the other side of Pam Greer with a hefty mustache. Okay, surprise and then behind him mustache. Is a woman I don't know wearing a bikini top. And then on the far end is a guy I don't know. <laughs> wearing a bikini Michael top. <laughs> <laughs> Tagline, mm -hmm. pretty long. Six players on the trail of ha of a half a million in cash. There's only one question. Who's playing who? So guess what, everybody? <laughs> Exciting news. We're almost at 100K. So if you're not subscribed, please subscribe uh, and help us get to 100. <laughs> yeah, it's the only thing keeping me warm at night. The thought of you guys subscribing. It's true. Oh, music right off the bat. Okay. Immediately. Awesome. He really does like this font, hey? Yeah. Trying to break out of the ghetto was a day to day fight. This is awesome. <laughs> <laughs> this is so cool. <laughs> uh, I'm assuming she's on one of those things at the airport. Like the, yeah, yeah. So she is stewardess, perhaps? Or a Looks flight like attendant? It. We don't use stewardess anymore. 1997. <laughs> you do? <laughs> I feel like this song is maybe help describing the movie a little bit. Just a lyric at the beginning. Hmm. Oh man, that tile in the background is so cool. <laughs> no, it just, it's all the, it, it just went from like blues to now like yellowies and things. It's, oh yeah, definitely airport. Okay. You got to be strong if you wanna so, so maybe I am a total asshole. It, she's a pilot. She's got those wings, right? Mm hmm. Oh, it's based on a book. Rum punch. Okay. Interesting. Rum punch sounds like a sex thing. <laughs> Thought it sounded like anime. <laughs> <laughs> Rum punch, man. Yeah. <laughs> oh no, she's not pilot. Unless in the nineties, pilots welcome passengers. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Chicks who love guns. <laughs> <laughs> is this real or is this the start of him making? I bet a hundred percent this is a real trailers. show. A hundred percent. This is a real show. <laughs> it feels like it could be. And Miss Orange County finalist. Or commercial. They advertised this Tech Nine as the most popular gun in American crime. I love my Tech Nine. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> my customers don't know shit about it, so there ain't no demand. <laughs> General does not care. <laughs> Forty-five got a serious fucking jamming problem. The killer had a 45, they want His a facial hair is something else. <laughs> this man is so good at monologues. I get the merchandise to him, he gets it wow. out. Wow. All right. <laughs> wow. <laughs> motherfucker rolling oh, it's touching the cash. glass. <laughs> AK-47, when you absolutely have to kill every motherfucker in the room. <laughs> Jeepers. <laughs> That's a great lie. What's for you? Girl, don't make me put my foot in your ass. Ooh. Okay. So he's an arms dealer. Mm-hmm. Hello, it's for you. <laughs> <laughs> that was great. Jumba, Has up? Robert De Niro said anything this whole time? No, it'd be great if he just, just doesn't talk in the whole movie. Mm. <laughs> so when did you get out of jail? Four days ago. How long? I had four years. For what? Like Robert. Oh, shit, I'm impressed. Because of that nigga, I'm going to make twelve fifty off of this nigga. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's uncomfortable. <laughs> Motherfuckers come straight out the Gulf War. Well, no, it's not for him. <laughs> I already got a half million sitting down in Mexico. Then I'm out. Spend the rest of my life spending. So that's the half million? <laughs> <laughs> oh, it is for him. She just left Yeah. Her. <laughs> you got better sense than be drunk driving with a goddamn pistol? That's what them motherfuckers get paid for and scare the shit out of you. So that kitchen... Is that the same kitchen that Tarantino was in in Pulp Fiction? I feel like it's bigger in Pulp Fiction. Mm. I'm gonna get you out tomorrow. Now, where are you? Reggie is in big trouble. I'd like you to make sure that he's there when I get there. Thank you very much. Put him back on the line, please. 
Where can I put my ash? I need me a bond mm -hmm. for 10000 What have you got to put up for collateral? Gonna have to use cash. Okay. Who's it for? A fella named Beaumont. They got him down in county. He from Kentucky. If he runs and I have to go to Kentucky to bring him back, you pay the expenses. So he gets this guy, the bail bonds, to pay the bail so he doesn't have to go through the court and they deal with it. I guess, yeah. Yeah, viewers can tell us comments, right, more details how this all works. Mm -hmm. Just a busy keychain. I mean, the door's unlocked. <laughs> It's very controlling. Yeah. Yeah, with the phone and the the, the <laughs> things. <laughs> He's working on four years probation. Possession of unregistered machine guns. This boy's mm. looking at ten years. Mm. Plus the concealed weapon. I need your name and address. Ordell Roby. She been a factor, nigga. I'm coming up. Look at you and your free ass. What's up, man? Okay, so so far he's got two berets. Mm-hmm. You get your ass in trouble, I get your ass out. I'm still scared to the motherfucker OD. And they're just trying to put a fright in your ass. I'm gonna pick you up, take you over to Century City, introduce that you to That chin braid is so distracting. I know, it keeps on wobbling. <laughs> he okay. lived to fuck with the police. He said, you ain't got shit to worry about. I need a favor, nigga. <laughs> that was pretty clear. <laughs> <laughs> You home because I spent $10,000 to get your ass home. I need some help. You can help me out. You remember them three M60 machine guns? Definitely the most unique look for Samuel Jackson yet I've seen. Even more than uh, Kingsman? That one's more about the list. Now, I'm going to sell them <laughs> to other people. You got to worry about them shooting in the back. You know what I'm saying? All you got to do is lay in here and hold it's on. It's like Jules prototype. Hmm. I ain't saying nothing about you shooting nobody. All you gotta do is hold on to it. They'll get the idea. Man, I ain't riding in no goddamn trunk for no minute. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's doing something to him. I got a problem with small places. Man, I wanna help you, but I won't be locked in no goddamn trunk or no car. I feel like this movie so far could be like broken up into like single She's words looking, for each looking. character. Yeah. Like ten thousand dollars, no truck. Like you're like, you know, like back and <laughs> yeah, forth, yeah, back yeah. and forth. Like it's so funny. And this shot, he really likes the shot. Mm. From the trunk. Upwards. Hey, you said ten minutes. Your pony's hell wearing motherfucker. Hell roll with you. From now on, anytime I tie my hair up, that's not what I want to be called. <laughs> you got it, George. <laughs> so he's dead, right? Who? Chris Tucker, isn't that the idea? No, no, he's the he surprise didn't, element. He didn't seem very, he's lying to him. No, he's not. He no, he's not. Happy he did not spend ten thousand dollars to get him out of jail just to kill him. He's the surprise element with this favor. I think he's telling the truth. He also gave him a shotgun. I feel like he's doing something to him. Nah. Oh, it just got really quiet. <clears throat> just around the block. Well, this is suspicious. <laughs> this <Yeah. laughs> but up until this point. Ever, up until this point, it was suspicious. No. Someone telling you to get in the trunk is suspicious. Don't get into strange men's trunks, someone. <laughs> I told you. What? That doesn't make any sense. <clears throat> when he found out he got the 10 years after this and the bail and all that stuff, he just seemed like he wasn't happy with him, right? Like, he's a liability or but something. But he was, he was, it's like, and Chris Tucker as Beaumont, and they're just gonna shoot him with 20 minutes into the film? Yeah. Well, color me surprised. I mean, Tarantino killing characters is not exactly <laughs> unusual. <laughs> what? <laughs> he just seems very uncomfortable. Really? I think he's so chill. He like doesn't speak loudly. He just kind of mumbles and he's just like, whatever. <laughs> I don't know. So far, I'm 1-0. I'm <laughs> it's not a competition, George. Louis, babe, it's so dead. I'm just hanging out with Simone. Oh, yeah? She doing that show for you? Oh. What? <laughs> <laughs> well, guess where I am? I don't know. Right outside Simone's house. What? <laughs> okay. A employee I had to let go. He was gonna have to do 10 years in prison. You know, ain't no goddamn way he can do 10 years. Uh, so he'll talk. Hmm. If you're gonna come in on this thing with me, you got to be prepared. I'll shoot this nigga in the head and 10 niggas look just like him. Where's Pam Greer? I miss Pam Greer. <laughs> <laughs> me too. There she is. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> Would you mind if we just took a look in that bag? You have the right to say no, and I have the right to make you wait here with Ray while I go get a warrant. You have a good flight? <laughs> $50,000 here. Well, you should know if you bring in anything over 10000 you have to declare it. 
Now you want to talk to us about this, or do you want to talk to customs? Okay. According to this, this isn't the first time that you've run afoul of the law. Hey, Jackie, do you know a guy named... Someone thanks Uh... Oh. They're gonna make her... They found him in the trunk of a car this morning. If you don't know Beaumont, why do you suppose Beaumont knows you? If you cooperate, you tell us what we want to know. We'll I don't like the guy with this. the mustache. <laughs> if I was a 44-year-old black woman, I don't think that I'd think I had a year to throw away. <sighs> what an asshole. I'm not saying another goddamn word. Beauty case. What's in it? Beauty products. Oh, uh -huh. shit. What's this shit? So she doesn't even know what she was Ooh, smuggling. Ooh, brutal. I'll never be free. Possession of narcotics with the intent to distribute. Do you have a bail recommendation? No less than twenty-five thousand. I'm gonna set bond at ten thousand. That's six weeks from now, Miss Brown. We'll continue this matter then. Significantly less. Yeah. Still a lot. Yeah, and then six but weeks <laughs> waiting in jail, waiting. So does the judge know him, or she does work for him, and he's there making sure she didn't say anything? Oh, or that. Yeah, or that. Caught with less than two ounces. They call that shit intent. You know her last name? Brown. My friends get in trouble. I like to help them out. I'd say you're in the drug business, except the money's moving in the wrong direction. Jackie ain't no criminal. She ain't used to this kind of treatment. Is white guilt supposed to make me forget I'm running a business? I got you a little thousand bucks. Dropping off Lopez, Anita, picking up Brown. So he is just like the intermediary that everybody has to go through. Because mm -hmm. even the police side knows him. Yeah. yeah I'm really, I, I have zero yes, knowledge about how any of this works. So it's fascinating and confusing. Mm hmm. Bail bonds are like an organization outside of police and, you know, like it's mm. it's an, a different industry, right? Like it, I've heard it referred to as a scam, like a legal scam. Oh, music cue. Mm. Is he going to fall in love? That's what I thought, too. <laughs> I think so. <laughs> Slow zoom. Music cue. What do we <laughs> I could give you a lift home if you like. What a meet cute. <laughs> Picking her up from jail, bailing her out. No. You're really a bail bondsman. Who do you think I am? Can I see your ID? She's a smart woman. Mm hmm Well, a hundred percent she might think that like oh, yeah. he's his he's gonna kill her now. She shouldn't go home. Samuel Jackson's attitude is very different when talking to about it is. her bond. It, yeah, yeah, it was. And I think it's because he witnessed her in court yeah. being like Yeah. No thanks. I quit three years ago. <laughs> if I can't fly him, I have a bitch of a time trying to find my brand. If you want, I could Help you figure out your options. If I stand mute, I can get as much as five years. Do you happen to know who put the dope in your bag? That's not what this is about. They were waiting for my ass. Thanks for the Oh shit. Oh wow. Oh okay. shit. Oh yeah, I don't like this. This is this isn't good. He's putting on the gloves. Oh, okay. How you doing, Miss Jack? I want to flick his little chin braid. <laughs> oh my god. Subsequently get shot, but whatever. Jesus, yeah, and you deserve it. Ugh. Oh! You sure you didn't get nervous and kind of let something slip? Oh God! They knew about the money. They knew the exact amount. You ain't say nothing about me. Mm -mm. <laughs> That's so sinister. Somebody must have been real mad at all. Oh! Woman. What is going on? You scared of me? <gasps> she took his gun. Oh! That is a great reveal. What's wrong with you, Jackie? She is so fucking <laughs> awesome. That ain't got nothing to do with you. <laughs> now sit your ass down. Oh, I love this so much. The whole movie mm -hmm. up to this point, he's like always in power and like all like. Mm -hmm. I have to tell you to shut up one more time. I'm gonna shut you up. Sooner or later, they're gonna get around to offering me a plea deal. That's why you came here to kill me. Now I forgive you. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I want $100,000 in an escrow account in my name. I can do that. Wow. You point that motherfucking gun somewhere else. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, that's awesome. That definitely was one of my favorite reveals of like all the movies we watched cuz it's so simple. It was simple. Have, like, it was simple and screen. yeah, and yeah. It, but it was great. And timed. Oh. I like that he waited till next morning, though. Yeah. You know, I was afraid to ask to borrow it. Would you like some coffee? If you're having some. I am. Oh, the milk went bad while I was in jail. Black's fine. Care to hang on to it for a while? It wouldn't be legal, but, uh... He likes her. Let's see. I got one now, okay? <laughs> <laughs> you never got into the whole CD revolution? I don't get new stuff that often. I give my heart a soul. <laughs> <laughs> he called. He 
came hmm. by. We talked. There's got to be other ways of getting it out. You can offer to set them up. If I get off, otherwise, fuck oh, shit. It. Max, how do you feel about getting off? You look great. No, I'm asking you, how do you feel? <laughs> <laughs> she didn't say about her. <laughs> <laughs> you look exactly the way you did at 29. I'm asking the same. Bigger. Yeah. Nothing wrong with that. <laughs> oh, he's trying so hard. You know, I make 16000 a year. If I lose this job, I got to start all over again. And that shit is more scary than ordeal. Fair enough. Okay, Michael oh, Keaton. Yeah. <laughs> He's sunglasses. Just so Keaton. Oh, <laughs> it's like Nicholas Cage. Just... I didn't see the the bike helmet again, so he's wearing leather now. <laughs> I need permission to leave the country so I can keep my job. If I'm working, I can help you. Get Odell Roby. You know how he makes his money. He sells guns, and in return for my help, I need permission to leave the country on immunity. It's possible. <laughs> oh Jesus. You getting high already? <laughs> that shit's gonna rob you of your ambition. <laughs> I like that they made his tattoos like like a faded like yeah. black. It's kind of shitty, kind of yeah. <clears throat> well, they're just like old, right? Like <laughs> they're they're really bad tattoos. <laughs> yeah. I get high at night when I get through all my business. <laughs> When was the last time I saw you? Like seven years ago. How old were you in this picture? Fourteen. I thought you were at least sixteen. I hope Robert De Niro's character spends the whole movie doing nothing but just getting high. <laughs> yeah, I have a feeling he might, you know, be. Sleep with her. Yeah. I mean, maybe, yeah, but that. like he seems so like chill. But I think there might be like a point where he like kills people or something. With Ordell? <laughs> oh yeah, no, absolutely. He's definitely the. Well, that's a picture of me in Japan. That's the guy that I live with. You know, I couldn't speak any Japanese, and his English was terrible. You know, we didn't have that much to say to each other anyway. I so funny having the, the like the two time. actors in the scene face just away from the camera the yeah. whole time. <laughs> One five. <laughs> that's Japan. <laughs> <laughs> Three, Three minutes, minutes later. later. Oh, okay. Oh, still going at it. Okay. Oh no, never mind. That was fun. He did just come out of prison. Just once I oh. like to see a movie where after the sex scene, the characters go clean themselves. Mm. This is adorable. He goes and gets a cassette. That's amazing. Oh. <laughs> oh, I don't want anything bad to happen to them. I feel like bad things will happen because to the bondsman, I think. Yeah. Yeah. Hey. Wow, that bar is amazing. How are you doing? Oh, I'm fine. Yes, you are. <laughs> 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 they already know I'm meeting you. Look, the only way they're going to give me permission to fly is if I agree to help them. What the fuck? <laughs> All they want to do is catch your ass with guns. I make two deliveries. In the second delivery, I come in with a half meal. The night he came to, like, kill her, and she, mm -hmm. and she took his gun and stuff, I was like, oh, she's going to... Make a plan to work with him. Oh, see me hand the ten but then she went and talked to the cops. Ooh. And I was like, oh, okay, what she's going to turn him in. But now this, I'm like, I don't know what's happening. But I love it. Hey, don't forget to check out our Patreon for these exclusives. And now back to the movie. So we're going to need two women. That's your partner. I'm your manager. And a manager gets 15%. The manager gets 10%. <laughs> <laughs> no, oh, that is hilarious. <laughs> oh my god. So he says, fuck that, and moves over into guns. It's interesting. She's just been telling the truth the entire movie so far. Yeah. Come on. It's everyone else who projects and assumes that she's not. You gotta admit, he's not too bright. He moves his lips when he reads. What does that tell you? <laughs> <laughs> he went to go meet that stewardess. Did he tell you about that half million he's got down in Mexico? Let him and the stewardess get the money over here. Just. Take it from them. Okay. okay. That's, yeah, the tagline makes sense. Yeah, everybody's after it, right? So we've got the two oh, cops, Come on, you ain't gonna get Jackie Brown, De Niro, and Samuel Jackson. Orville? That bitch gonna be fucking you two minutes after I'm out the door. <laughs> <laughs> no, so she ain't your girlfriend. But you fucked her anyway, though, huh? No. <laughs> well, I hope you felt appropriately guilty afterwards. Afterwards, I did. <laughs> <laughs> but what is she to you? You just one of the bitches I got set up. But you trust Melanie around your business? She trying to play your ass against me, ain't she? You can't trust Melanie, but you can always trust Melanie to be Melanie. Mmm, okay. So he had like, um, what is his name? Lewis is Robert De Niro's character. He's also telling right. the truth. Actually, everybody's kind of telling the truth. Nobody's really lying. Uh-oh, 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 okay. <laughs> well, the money's going to be in the Del Amo shop bag. Uh-oh. So does he know that she's there or did they just happen to be at the same place? 
I think it's accidental. Hey, no, it's accidental. Small world. <laughs> and he's gonna think, yeah. Yeah. He's been real nice. He just tries to act cool. He's more interested in Ardell than he is in the money. Went back to my <laughs> office and found out that you took my gun. <laughs> Did you do that that night? Well, the guy never came home. And after a couple of hours, I think, what am I doing this? If you had the chance to walk mm -hmm. away with a half million dollars, would you take it? Wait, is she making a deal with him now? Like, yes. are they gonna? Ooh! You gotta stop me. <laughs> Michael Keaton just. He's so. It's. Yeah, he's so charming. It's just so like he's so likable. What are you doing? Recording all this. The envelope contains one hundred dollar bills. Delamo Fashion Center bag. The bag is purple. White. <laughs> I was thinking the same thing. It is. <laughs> <laughs> no wonder this movie's two and a half hours. No, but every moment is like I. Oh, it's so great! It's yeah. so great. Yeah. Only Tarantino will put in these little, <laughs> little details of like covering over the bag color. The master of chit chat. Mm. Now I'm starting to get the feel that she's playing everybody against everybody. Hmm. Put the bag on the floor, okay? Under the table next to mine. So what's your name? Sharonda. It was nice talking to you. Okay, the switch. Mm-hmm. Oh. You said it yourself. The money won't convict him. I just can't do it without you. Hmm. Yeah. But they're gonna follow her. What's his, what's Max's play in this? What is he gonna do? Yeah, I don't know. I just I feel like she's using him. I hate to say it, but yeah, I think I think you're right. Oh, <gasps> she has a bag too. Oh. Okay, so Ordell thinks that his girl has it. Ooh. That but did was he her swap? Yeah. Interesting. And it looks it, he's smiling, so that's the plan. Maybe. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> yeah. Unless this Oh, the music just cuts. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> unless that was a red herring, but probably not. Right? No. Who's to say? Oh, so he's like he's there to observe to make sure nobody notices. Yeah. Okay. Chick you saw stomping around the back there. That's Melanie who's about to leave. <laughs> Jesus. Call Simone. Tell her to get her ass over here. I think I'm missing her? something. Tell them we do the same thing as before. And they'll follow us around. Lewis. <laughs> she ain't there? Yo. <laughs> He's so high. So stoned. <laughs> this time, you're going to get Sharonda a Billingsley bag. You're going to take the Billingsley bag Simone gives you and give it to Sharonda. Odell has a bag with oh, wow. his name, Lewis. He was at Odell's apartment in Hermosa Beach. He definitely works for Odell. He's not living on Hermosa Beach, though. <laughs> his leather jacket is so squeaky. Yeah. Hawkins, Simone Hawkins. They were talking about her? Yeah. Oh, that was her first lie. I told him Odell's changing the amount he's bringing in. Oh, my God. Okay. He's going to keep his half meal where it is, but... And where's the rest of it? In the bag underneath. You're taking a hell of a chance, kid. Yeah, it's risky, risky, risky. You're going to have surveillance all over you. Is she gone, her shit's gone, and my 10,000 motherfucking dollars. I only got just as much sense as that bitch has. She'd be in the same fucking place, all right? <laughs> For real this For real time. time. <laughs> <laughs> so far, I think this might be my favorite Tarantino movie. Really? Yeah. Okay. We have a few more to go, but once we're done, all of them, we, we're going to have to rank it. Personal mm. rankings. Oh, tell the viewers, tell us yours. Tell us your ranking of all nine Tarantino movies. Yeah. I don't think she should have put it right on top. She should have put something on top of that. Marking the bills in the upper left-hand corner and the second zero with the green. Guess we could take as much as we want. It's not like the money belongs to anybody. Wait, he's recording all of this. <laughs> no, he recorded the trial run, I think. But he just described seven, putting the pen thing, so he's still recording. Oh, right. I want you to put it in this Billingsley shopping bag. You said that before, let's go. Oh, she's gonna be late. What the fuck you still doing there, man? Drag a fucking ass out of there. She's like the, the babysitter character in uh, Goodfellas. Do you remember her? Just ruins everything. <laughs> he told her not to call from the house. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> or oh. whatever it was, yeah. So what, she just pocketed like $10,000? Yeah, it's hard to track the money now. <laughs> like, we'll just let the movie tell us. Mm-hmm. They're late, so she's getting nervous. Hmm. Wow, you look really cool. <laughs> I'll take it. I'm in a hurry. Can you ring it up for me? Okay. You got something for me? You betcha. Oh, wow, like same towel and everything. I put a cherry on top. 
<laughs> Holy shit. I decided to wear this suit instead of my turtle uniform. This is getting scary. Okay, then is Max gonna come in being like I left <laughs> some beach towels? Yeah. I don't know what's going on. I don't I don't know what went wrong that she's like been panicking ever since she left the dressing room. Mm. There's so many long shots in this movie. Yeah. I forgot to mention, like, that earlier scene when her at her house, Samuel Jackson first showed up, going dark and light and dark. Like, oh, that was one shot. long take. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, God, okay. Good job, Tarantino. I am panicking. <laughs> I'm uncomfortable. Mm hmm She burst into the dressing room. She took all the money and ran out. Oh. She's being watched the whole time, so the whole time she was panicking because... Right. Oh! But what's her play with telling the the store clerk that someone left the thing though that's what i don't remember oh there's there's max i think i like it I'll oh i it. completely missed yeah, it camera, camera panned right by him yeah oh. oh okay 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 hello movie <laughs> hey would you let go is he gonna clock max oh yeah okay <laughs> but if you two aren't the biggest <laughs> pair of fuck ups i've ever met in my entire life <laughs> no wonder you went to jail. <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna say he did end up in jail. So. Yeah. Oh God. Don't say anything else, okay? Oh. Keep your mouth shut. Okay, Lewis. Oh, that okay. whole time I was like, one. please don't snap, please don't snap, and wow, yeah. wow. Should have just kept smoking weed. Now we get to see his side. The thing that weirded me out was like the the nod and like the acknowledgement mm -hmm. of like Well if anything grabs you, don't be shy. Like if someone catches you looking at them and you look away, it's more noticeable than mm. Hey, would you let go? And then that was just enough to make him paranoid. <laughs> just one look. Yeah, and she starts looking panicked. And away we go. Oh. Someone uh, left a bag of beach towels in the last dress. Yeah, and oh, oh. Mm -hmm. And then he just walks up and be like, oh, I forgot some a bag with some towels. Oh, <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Making sure no one shows up first, no cops or whatever. Oh my god. Go get him. There's nobody in there. Oh my okay. goodness. Just grab it and go, man. Grab it and go. I'm so nervous. I started like picking my nail polish off. <laughs> but but there's still like. Over half an hour to go, so yeah, I still don't think he's end. safe, especially oh. not after Lewis saw him too. Like that. Is he gonna see the shooting? Oh. Or the body? Is that the body? I see blood. No, never mind. No. Okay. <laughs> I'm too excited. I thought that was spit blood. What's he Are gonna think about? Pissed. Is he though? I don't know. No money, girl dead. No, he's got the money. He's got some of the money. He's got ten grand on top. This aisle, Lewis, is it that aisle, Lewis? It's totally no, there's more money under the towel, and then the, the stuff that Pam Greer pocketed, she put on top. You shot her twice? Jesus. Is she dead? <laughs> right, right. Where'd you shoot her? In the chest and the stomach. <sighs> oh, there is, but, but not everything. Yeah, yeah. just enough. <laughs> Where's the rest of it? You like about half me and ten. Well, she's telling me the truth. She came out with that fucking bag. <laughs> And now she's dead. It looks even dirty on him. Yeah. <laughs> Whatever. At least the heat's not on Max and, and Jackie. She got the 15% that I Jackie Brown wanted. Yourself. The gears are a turning. <laughs> it's Jackie Brown. She put them books in there to trick I am. She wants me to know she ripped me off. What if she gave the money to somebody else first? Oh, is he going to put it together now? He does become a master Jedi later. Mr. Parma? No, no Jedi, not, not, not him. him. <laughs> you going to tell me who you saw? Yeah, Max Cherry. Right, and he you saw them at the food court. The oh yeah. boy. I don't fucking, I'm giving you fucking reasons. You gonna tell me reasons? Your ass ain't worth the shit Will no you? more. <gasps> oh. Oh. Okay. Like, we all knew that was coming, but like. Yeah. Yeah. Very Tarantino-esque. Everyone I dies. didn't <laughs> think that he would do it just like right there, though. Yeah, we really shouldn't be surprised anymore I know, when people I know. die unceremoniously in a Tarantino movie. Do Max and Jackie have time to get out of I got all that shit hanging over my head like you got hanging over yours she doesn't know Mel died right I swear Melanie burst in she grabbed the bag and I went back to the place in the mall where you were before but you weren't there there's a guy with Melanie but there was nobody in the fitting room you have no idea what the 50 grand did she know that Lewis was gonna be with Melanie yeah because Samuel Jackson called her 
But she couldn't have said that because then it yeah. would have been telling that she knew that Melanie exactly. was going to be there. Yeah. And she's rolling with the fact that Melanie's dead. Blue scar is dead. So what's going to happen now? Pick up Ordell. Yeah, because she was counting on them picking him up. You think I took some of that money? You've been helping us out. You gave us Melanie. If there's anything else you haven't told me about, better hope we find him before he finds you. Yep. <laughs> yeah. I'm seeing who my friends are, motherfucker, right? Hello? Motherfucker. Well, give me his home number. No, I give you his beeper number. I've been looking for you. Oh, my God. Tell me where you are. I'll come give you your money. I know you helped him. Well, you just tell her to think about old Beaumont. I don't have to know what I'm doing. Just as long as you know. You looking to get shot? Oh, God, he still got blood on his shirt. Oh, oh freeze, hey. motherfucker. What you doing? You want your money? She wants to give you your money. She wants to collect it 10%. Jackie didn't trust Melanie. Ordell knows that Melanie wanted to split it with Lu Lewis already. So that's mm -hmm. believable. My ass may be dumb, but I ain't no dumb ass. <laughs> <laughs> Where my money at? My office. She won't leave there till you get your money and you're gone. See, I ain't trust Melanie either, but I could handle her. I call over there. She better answer the phone. God, I'm nervous. Oh, is this still part of their plan or she's just winging it now? I don't know. I don't know. I had just like well, a horrible be, feeling. Be, yeah. Yeah. Because she found out that he was. Yeah. 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 Now she's calling the cops. That's way more than I'm on. <laughs> 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 Tarantino's just gonna make us wait for it. Yep. It must be so jarring too in the theater when it's like super loud and then quiet. Mm, here we go. My money's in Ooh, the Ooh, lights off. Last chance, motherfucker. Again, this movie is so good. Say, Jackie. <laughs> yeah. Okay. 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 She's just gonna do it. Bray's got a gun! Yes. Oh. Oh my god. Oh my God, he did not have a gun. Oh, he did have a gun. Okay, okay. But now, holy shit. Oh boy. Even better. She didn't even have to do it herself. <laughs> Why'd you give him $10,000? You turned a bond collateral. Eh? And all the paperwork, all the paperwork mm -hmm. is. Remember when you said you hope you get him before he gets me? Well, you did. Wow. Okay. She didn't even need to get her hands dirty. It was fun getting a half million dollars in the mail. Well, I'm leaving now and, you know, I'm all packed up, ready to go. I didn't use you, Max, and I never lied to you. I can't blame anybody for anything I do. Are you scared of me? A little bit. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'll go with you, Pam Greer. <laughs> me too. <laughs> oh, good on you, Max. I'll send you a postcard. Oh. What is it your son's charged with? Oh. oh. Is your son still in school? Could I excuse myself? Would you call me back? Okay, what? Just gotta collect himself? Mm. Okay. Wow. Oh, buddy. <laughs> I'm not saying what I did was all right. Yeah, see? The lyric. <laughs> Doing what I gotta do to survive. I'm not yes. saying what I did was all right. Yes. Yeah. Jackie Brown is like one of my favorite characters of all time. Mm -hmm. She's so awesome. Oh. oh, wow. Oh, man. And that last shot of like it totally out of focus and like to on his back. Mm -hmm. And then you just see him like raise his hands to his. Oh, it's just like. Just. Oh. Oh, man. That was so turned on. Jesus. <laughs> Jesus. The man was heartbroken. Why do you, why did you make it gross? I don't know why I do this to myself. I've like I wanted to watch this for like so long and for some reason I just mm -hmm. like never watch <laughs> movies I want to watch. Just keep you know? watching Gilmore Girls. <laughs> I just always watch Gilmore Girls. <laughs> and then the list gets longer and longer. Like there's so, yeah, it's just and I think it's because I know I'll love them. Like, I knew mm -hmm. I was going to love this movie. And so I was like, oh, no, I'll save it for later. I'll save it for later. You know, like, what's wrong with me? <laughs> Collecting all the potions in a game and you never use it till the end. <laughs> I mean, just kept, kept us guessing the whole time. The, I the mean, information it did and it did it. so well. Yeah, I agree. I agree. Mm -hmm. It's like we were, it, 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 like I said, it did and it didn't. Like, we, everything was given to us. Yeah. There was still some, we didn't know if <clears throat> Ordell was was going to be able to take power back. That's what that's the thing we didn't know. Yeah, but I, I felt like what we figured out were at the moment that the movie wanted us to figure it out. You know what I mean? Oh, for sure. So like, yeah, it wasn't confusing all the way through because then that would just make, you know, viewer few 
frustrated or the, or the story feel convoluted, right? Mm-hmm. But if we figured out too early, then then we're just waiting for the characters to figure things out, which is also boring. Yeah. No. This was this. Yeah, this is just movie like, was just perfect. Right. Yeah. 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 Things were big fan. Big fan revealed. of this film. Yeah, 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 yeah. I also really love that at the end there, she was asking him to run away with her, essentially. I loved that. Which is such a, yes. a flip on such a common cliche, right? Like, you well, know. Well, I mean, the common thing asked. was that they both run away together. That too. too. That too. So, yeah, too, yeah, yeah, like, oh, I loved it. I loved it so which much. Which is kind of a bittersweet, you know, very, ending. That very that bittersweet. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I also love the casting of this. Mm-hmm. Like, mm-hmm. I feel like at the hands of any other director or studio interference, they would have been like, no, cast like the hot 20 year old of the 90s or whatever. Do you know what I mean? Because it's like a, it's a crimey kind of drama. Oh, I see. Oh, OK. Yeah. Right. Yeah, but, I guess. Like, yeah. yeah. Like the love interest is a 50 year old man. Right. Yeah. Like, a, like a dad, you know, <laughs> <laughs> it's great. The cliches are are so not there. Alrighty, that wraps up this episode of Cinebinge. Thank you everyone for watching with us and uh, yeah, do the things. Subscribe, yeah, like, like the things. Patrons. Thank our patrons for helping us keep doing this and shout out to A Bit Andy, Carl's in charge, yeah. AC10, Always Dead, uh, Ben AM, uh, Brendan Mang, Craziest Relative, Crow, uh, Dave Atcher, Draco Argentum, Dragison, Eric Gray, Fat Man, uh, Gleeful Turtle, uh, J, Jacob Archer 78, James Lee, Jay Davis, Jelly Delicious, Joe Swenson, and Jojo Reese. Thank Thanks, you all everybody. very much. Bye. Bye.